Hi, I'm Trish from Speedwell Software. In this clip, we'll look at a student answering a mixed question paper in the Speedwell eSystem. The student can customise the delivery screen if they want to. And they'll need a username and a password set by the school to sign in. This student has already taken some tests and these can be taken off by the teacher when they're finished. There are some more tests which are due to be taken now. This is a general school sample test with questions from a couple of different subjects, but normally each subject would set its own tests. This test is timed as well. Most of the questions like this multiple choice question will be marked automatically as the students go through the test. This question has an image and it's a single correct answer. The student can see which question they're on in the progress bar on the right and they can flag a question and it shows here if they want to come back and review it later. The next question is a written question. The teacher will mark this written question once the test has been taken. The student reads the question, types their answer in this box below. And when a teacher sets a question like this, they also set up a marking scheme so that when they go back into mark, they can clearly see how many marks should be awarded for each point that the student has written correctly. This is a hotspot question, again marked automatically. The teacher set this up by mapping out a correct click area and if the student clicks in there, then they'll receive a mark for it. The next question is a very short answer question. To set this up, the teacher has typed in all acceptable answers or phrases and these are automatically marked by the system. They can be reviewed later as well in case the teacher decides to allow marks for words or phrases that were not on the original list. Question five is another simple multiple choice question. And this last section is a set of choice questions. Lots of information here. The teacher can pop images into the question or texts as images as we have done here. This is quite a nice way for the students to go back through the question and refresh themselves with a little bit of extra information in the boxes as they work through the question. This layout is nice for detailed sections of work with lots of multiple choice questions attached to it. Once the student has finished, they'll be able to review anything they want to. Here, looking at the one they flagged, they can go back into it and change their mind if they want to, and then finish. For each test, there's the option of showing immediate feedback. This might be a key phrase the teacher wants the student to remember, or maybe a standard feedback set by the school. They go back to exams, they can take another test, they can look at feedback or results depending on what the teachers have published for them. Then they log out. I hope you found this clip useful. If you'd like more information about student tests at your school or the Speedwell eSystem, or if you'd like to book a free demo, please contact us at speedwellsoftware.com.